yes ma'am definitely it's your channel uh, which diary which helped me start my preparation to uh, kick and boost this preparation from the very first uh, the month of the when i start from the uh, start the preparation so hello and welcome to vets diary friends today as always we have a very special guest so i welcome dr shivangi tripathi to my channel thank you ma'am thank you so much hello everyone my name is shivangi tripathi and i am from mathura i have completed bbsc and ah this year from college of veterinary science and animal husbandry dovasu mathura that you said as you received all india rank 30 okay yes, so it is also one of the great achievements so i would like to ask that how did you prepare for icr exam and uh, you got rank 13 in veterinary science so as yes, we generally consider that veterinary science is tougher than animal science so kindly tell me we'll uh, go by one one topic so first tell me that what were the resources you followed i started the preparation from my own notes uh, which were definitely excellent apart from it uh, in our college uh, a dedicated class for the preparation of the pg entrance um, is uh, there so the notes which i got from there is also up to the mark apart from it i followed various kind of books like dhruv and desai and vet rapidex and vet scan which i followed uh, mainly i uh, focused on uh, dhruv desai uh, and uh, vet scan and after that some uh, teachers like uh, dr rashmi which uh, teaches uh, the which uh, give the courses for this i followed that and also vet informatics i will i would like to mention that particular test series vet informatics helped me so much they are uh, no uh, test series are also up to the mark and uh, in the on those test series there are questions uh, which are uh, like assertion reasons and the uh, matchings which usually come in the exam and uh, all the students find it difficult than other normal type of the questions so these are the uh, resources which i followed okay so you basically mentioned the books and you also mentioned some online sources that you used yes ma'am okay so any telegram channel that helped you telegram channels like ma'am uh, vet, vet informatics informatics vet hub these are the channels which i uh, followed uh, for the preparation okay and any youtube channel that helped you yes ma'am definitely it's your channel uh, vet diary which helped me start my preparation to uh, kick and boost this preparation from the very first uh, the month of the when i start from the uh, start the preparation okay so uh, shivangi as you uh, correctly mentioned that when we are able when we are going to start anything nowadays then generally we first search it on uh, search it on youtube okay to look uh, for people who have cleared it earlier so yes, was it your first step to to uh, initially go to youtube and uh, take a look on the toppers and how they have cleared it yes ma'am uh, because uh, we are uh, we uh, are preparing for our exam internal examinations of our university and it is only the subjective exams so we have no idea about what is going to come in this icr pg exam and also the pattern of the exam is uh, very much changed and also the vci curriculum also have been changed so uh, we start also, uh, everyone i think for any examination start from the youtube and telegram and these kind of resources so first uh, i uh, i when i when i think when i thought of you know, preparing for this exam i started uh, i just google, googled and also got on the youtube and search for those people who have achieved good ranks in the veterinary science stream and uh, saw their interview on the youtube channel and the mode of their preparation uh, and the resources they use and then only i started uh, the preparation now, this was your first step that you initially searched for those who scored good ranks okay so then what what was your next step you moved towards your books uh, gradually your notes gradually you started revising them preparing them from when did you start your preparation it was uh, from internship or it was from first year second year or third year as generally people think that okay we have to do pg so we prepare start preparing early ma'am actually uh my uh, the preparation started from internship only yeah i uh, studied along with the fourth year also some subjects like pathology and microbiology but uh, it was not great the preparation wasn't great 
because I was preparing for the fourth year examination also, and also it was my final year. The it 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 is of one point five year duration. So in that year, all uh, everyone uh, every student want to indulge in some kind of other activities like extra co curricular activities also. So I was also the part of some of those activities. So I couldn't focus on the preparation of the JRF. So my preparation started from February twenty twenty three only, and the exam held on seventh July twenty twenty three. So I got a stretch of five to six month for the preparation. Okay, so uh, that means that five to six months is enough for uh, this ICR preparation. Uh, yes, ma'am. If you uh, are working hard and your concept are quite clear from first from first to fourth uh, four year, all the subjects you have built a strong concept. Then I think five to six months are enough uh, for uh, preparing for this examination. Okay. So what kind of paper was this year? Uh, it was tough, easy, or moderate? Um, I think the question paper was moderate. All the questions which I think uh, I have uh, attempted correctly are from my notes uh, and the notes of my college and uh, other resources which I have preferred. The question paper was uh, uh, like con uh, the question paper is conceptual on the base based on the concept. It is nothing like uh, uh, they have asked anything which uh, you don't know or yeah or from. post graduation the syllabus or phd syllabus it is all, all, all have been the level of the question paper was moderate all the question were conceptual based on the concept which i have learned in the past 4 years and uh, i think my notes and uh, the notes which are provided by the university was good enough to prepare and to crack that as examination okay with a good in all india rank Okay, Shivangi. So that means that if one prepares the his or her notes diligently in all the five and a half years uh, time period, then this exam is not a tough nut to crack. Yes, ma'am. Definitely, one okay. should focus on what they have taught in the uh, classroom classroom only. Then they can easily crack the examination. Okay. So Shivangi, you also mentioned about the classes which your teachers take during for this preparation specifically. so how much that class has helped you actually uh, ma'am uh, in our regular classes we have been uh, uh, taught uh, in a in, in a certain kind of a manner to prepare for subjective examination but uh, in uh, the classes which are specially designed for our icr examination in in those examination teacher will uh, uh, teacher taught us in a manner like they Uh, will give us one liners and uh, the last year questions which are more important they teach us what are more important what is more important and what kind of question can uh, come in the assertion reasons so they teach uh, us in a uh, uh, extremely different manner so this will uh, that will definitely help me and my all other batchmates to uh, prepare and crack the examination okay so it must be a revision kind of thing for you all also with some additional notes which have been left earlier yes ma'am okay so shivangi did you join any test series for this exam uh yes ma'am i have joined certain test series uh, one of which is the test series provided by wet informatics and uh, i think it is it was a good test series because all the questions were in assertion reason form or either in the assertion reason form or in the matching form which uh, usually people find difficult to attempt uh, in the examination and this this pattern in, is also new for uh, uh, students like us okay so uh, you also mentioned regarding the classes you took from rashmi ma'am uh, uh, i yes. have also heard of her that she takes coaching so is the coaching for both animal science or only for veterinary science ma'am it is for only veterinary science okay so I how much that those classes helped you ma'am uh, like i said uh, the classes from my uh, in my university they prepare for mcq and objective based questions and one liners uh, rashmi ma'am also uh, give the lectures uh, which have the content very to the point so i think uh, such kind of content for the preparation is uh, very important because we have we do not have time to cover the whole book or the whole uh, notes uh, whole theory because uh, here we have to cover a lot of thing a lot of things and this can only be possible when we uh, uh, study to the point and uh, short uh, we study in short so i think okay. these uh, kind of uh, uh, coachings and these kind of uh, course uh, curriculum classes are very important uh, for uh, a person who want to crack this kind uh, for, uh, want to crack icr examination 
ओके वेरी वेल सेट शिवांगी सो वॉट वॉज योर लास्ट टेन डेज स्केड्यूल बिफोर एग्जामिनेशन वॉट वॉर यू डू डूइंग टेन डेज बिफोर एग्जामिनेशन Yes, ma'am. Um, uh, actually, uh, in our case, the, uh, the date of the examination ca- uh, came very suddenly. We we are not expecting our examination to be in July. Actually, our seniors had their examination in September, so we are we were also expecting in it in to be in to be held in September or October. So uh, during the last ten. Uh, 10- a day and during the last 10 days before my examination i left all the things all the books and all the notes i just started revising from my short notes or the short notes given by any teacher or uh, by any uh, kind of coaching classes which i had done earlier okay yes i think this is uh, the most important thing because when there is a sudden date of examination then we have to also change whatever we have fixed earlier Yes, okay ma'am. so shivangi what was your strategy regarding solving paper how did you uh, strategized that whether you have to do how many questions because there is negative marking so how much questions did you attempt and how did you solve the paper so that you received good marks ma'am as it is a computer based chess there is a complete uh, interface in which uh, the there are options like Uh, how many questions you have attempted and how many uh, of those questions uh, which you have attempted uh, you are sure about and the unattempted ones so i think um, my approach was that ki i um, which uh, in the questions which are i am completely sure about i just click on the attempted question and then after that um, i have, in those questions which i am having some kind of doubt i leave uh, it on the doubtful questions and lastly i completely left those questions which i am completely unaware about and i have never heard about those questions because there is negative marking in the exam so there is no point of attempting such kind of questions you just uh, add some negative marks in your result and um, i think this is not beneficial and lastly when you are revising the questions you just uh, click on those question which you are uh, having doubt on and this read it again and then submit uh, and then uh, finally either you can Uh, correct it or you can clear it and lastly uh, the question paper get submit or uh, it or uh, submit submitted on its own so you have a no that's it ma'am okay so shivangi you chose veterinary science so yes, what was the good thing that you felt about veterinary science that you went for it and not for animal science ma'am uh, i have passed uh, this whole journey of 5.5 years and i think uh, being a veterinarian is mainly about diagnostic and treatment in my opinion so i preferred veterinary science because i have a keen interest in, in the field of diagnostic and treatment that is why i chose veterinary science because i want to go in do in that direction uh, so i think veterinary science is better if you want to pursue diagnostic treatment surgic surgery or any kind of uh, the uh, 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 surgery and uh, so this i think this uh, stream is better for those student who want to become a clinician or want to have their uh, practice in a private setup yes ma'am okay so uh, you uh, the the counseling has been done and uh, you which college did you got for pg ma'am i have been allotted with lovas hisar uh, okay. for the subject veterinary medicine okay so congratulations initially shivangi for receiving such a good college so what are the future prospects of veterinary medicine according to you because you went for it so what are the future prospects of it ma'am uh, veterinary medicine i think uh, it comes with a whole lot of opportunities and a very broad scope uh, one can easily set up their private practice apart from it the doors of many private companies or private sector get opened for the person who have uh, been the, who have done their post graduation from veterinary medicine apart from it academics is also a very nice option for one who want stability in their life and lastly the research field uh, the research uh, if anyone want to get in the research field want to become a scientist then they should uh, take veterinary medicine as their subject for post graduation i think okay shivangi so very nicely in a very good way you explained all the things and i hope that uh, the vets who are going to op- uh, appear in the examination this year 
they will definitely get a help from what you told in this video today and uh, i will also link all the things that she told regarding the telegram channels or the test series so that you all can get also access to it uh, uh thank you so much for this opportunity you have been uh, you have provided me i think this means a lot to me ma'am to get uh, uh, opportunities like this from your side and ma'am i would like you know, to uh, uh, request all the viewers to kindly like share and sub subscribe to ma'am's channel and they are helping uh, veterinary field in many great ways and we and this uh, can uh, i think this this should uh, go very far and this can only happen by subscribing and liking ma'am's channel thank you ma'am so thank you so much shivangi and i wish you all the best for your pg program which you are going to continue this year and uh, wish you luck for all the future endeavors you do Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you for for being so much helpful, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much, guys. I hope you all enjoyed this video, and this video helped you. So, if you like the video and our initiative, then please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our Vet Diary channel. Keep watching Vet Diary, and have a great day, guys. Bye bye. <laughs>